time to fight Not a single bad thought in my mind Put my guard down, put it to the side How you doing, man? I'm doing just fine What happened was, you know, I was driving for Uber And, you know, I picked the passenger up And, I, you know, she said she was sleeping I was like, fuck, I'm sleeping too So we got into the crib and we went, we went to sleep You know what I'm saying? There ain't no cheating I mean, keep, keep it 200 thou wow. You know what I'm saying? Niggas who wear this kind of sweater don't cheat. That's just facts, bro. Like, I mean, I ain't have the sweater on when it happened, but that's semantics. So, like, look, bro, like, that ass, like, you know, like, I, I said a long time ago, niggas who cheat deserve to have their dick cut off at the base and thrown into a river full of piranha. You know what I'm saying? I don't believe that no more. That's that's ridiculous. You know, that's, dick cut off at the base? Like, right? <laughs> Come on, y'all. Like, let's be, well, y'all don't take everything I say. Serious, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, y'all gotta remember too. Like, it's it's, it's really not cheating. If it, look, if it's less than ten strokes, it's not cheating. That's not cheating. And if you do it on a, a Tuesday before three o'clock, it's it's not cheating. Like, or a towel under the door, you're like, y'all don't know that y'all don't know the rules. So, see, y'all don't know. Y'all don't know the like. Yeah, first of all, we walked into the bedroom backwards. First, first of all, that show you right there, we wasn't cheating. And then, you know, we had the TV playing Moesha. And I ain't used no condom. I mean, like, that's that's one of the rules, too. Like, if I use the condom, that's that's cheating because I was planning on... See, you heard this before, right? You told me my grandma was out here on FaceTime, not that we was going live. Hmm, wow. What's up, y'all? I'm Derrick Jackson. Everybody been asking me to review this Derrick Jackson video, so, you know, I'm, I'm gonna go over it. Man, it's just, it's fucking ridiculous. Like, this dude, I don't know what's wrong with this dude. I don't know how he thought he was gonna get away with this, putting this video out. But it's, it's just fucking stupid. He sounds like an idiot. First of all, 10 strokes, everybody know that's cheating, all right? It's nine strokes. You can't go double digits. You go double digits, you cheating. That's just facts, bro. Like, what is wrong with bro? And, and I, I mean, he really just need to stop talking. He need to quit making videos, get off the internet, quit feeding people this bullshit. Everybody knows bullshit. And take his wife up to the bed They cheated. he cheated in and just lay her face down and start eating her from the back. I'm talking about aggressive Cuddling is from the back, like just vicious, non-breathing. Like he just need to stop breathing, face down in it, all the way in it. Just no, no more breathing for you. And, and if you happen to get a little bit of ass in your mouth, you deserve it, bro. Like because that's what you, that's what you did. So now I mean, me and you, you got you get a little bit of ass in your mouth. That's the, that's the least you can do. Okay, like you, you eat it from the back. Get a little bit of ass in your mouth and just stop putting out videos, bro, because we, we tired of it, bro, okay? Everybody knows you, you, you're bullshit, all right? So like all that love guru shit, it's, it's out the window for you. It's done. Hmm. What's up, y'all? I'm Derrick Jackson reviewing Derrick Jackson reviewing Derrick Jackson. And I'm, I'm, I mean, bro, bro got kind of a point. I mean, he do need to eat it from the back. But my thing is he talking about getting a little bit of ass in his mouth. No, he need to eat the whole ass. He need to eat the whole ass. Because that's the, I mean, like, bro's messed up, okay? And, like, like he got to go deep. And, like, he got to really dedicate himself to the ass eating. That's it, bro. That's all. You know what I'm saying? My other beef is why does dude wear sweaters in the house and T-shirts outside? I mean, like, bro, you you gonna catch p pneumonia, okay? <laughs> like, this you doing it backwards? Like, it's it's cold outside, but it's hot in your house. Like, I'm confused, bro. Like, you got a beanie on with the t-shirt. Are you picking out your clothes? Are you putting a grenade in the suitcase and then laying on on top of it or some shit? Like, what's what's going on, bro? Like, choose what season you in. Hey, y'all, uh, this Danaya, and you know, I just wanted to address a few things. Uh, the, the main thing being, of course, us wearing what we want to wear anytime. You know, because, like, everybody trying to figure out, like, hey, what's the temperature in the house? Like, why are you wearing a long sleeve shirt with shorts? And, and I just want to let y'all know it's because Jesus, uh, it's because of Jesus, whatever. So whatever Derek and I choose to wear and how we proceed to wear clothes, I mean, it don't matter if we just look like we tripped through a thrift store and fell out the back of the store after hitting every aisle of clothing. That is our prerogative, and that's between us and Jesus on God. And that includes hats too, so shut the fuck up, everybody. Mm, see, that's that's where that's where a lot of y'all women got it wrong. All y'all, really. Like, y'all, y'all think Jesus is gonna save y'all. <laughs> Jesus don't want y'all either. Jesus, do you think Jesus want a woman who got every hat out? You know what I'm saying? Wearing a sweatshirt in the house, you walk around musky. Jesus ain't finna save you. You got I'm, I'm gonna be real. All, most all y'all women going to hell. Bro is absolutely motherfucking right, bro. These bitches are going to hell. All of them, bro. That's why they always cold. It's cold. It's cold, bitch. You go, you cold because you're supposed to, you a demon. You a demon, bitch. You know what I'm saying? That's why you're just supposed to fuck them and leave them. That's all you put. Oh, God, bro, like dead ass. Like, you got, y'all niggas need to get like me, bro. I get on Tinder. I find the fattest, lowest self-esteem, fucking cross-eyed bitch I can find, and I give her that dick, and, you know, I come and give y'all advice on how to get bitches. That's what the fuck being an alpha male is. It's, it's fucking, fucking bitches. 
fucking the ugliest bitch you can find, giving niggas advice on how to fuck bitches. It, but they don't never see. Don't let them see your bitches though, because they don't need to know what kind of. But like on God, bro. And then you just you bump that Tory Lanes, nigga. Like you pump that shit and you ride through in a crown bit, and then and that's it, nigga. Raw, raw, raw shit. Alpha all male, of you need to stop listening to Offset, Migos, and the Future. I mean, so basically, my daughter read my book.